we've had just over a thousand days of engagement, one worldwide pandemic, three wedding dates across two planned venues in two different countries, and we've had 10 days of isolation for a COVID-stricken bride two weeks before the big day. <laughs> Thank you, Becky. So there I was, sitting on my own, minding my own business, <laughs> in a paint-stained suit from art class. And uh, I was trying to revise for an upcoming physics exam in a few weeks' time. And then the key was a flustered ball of emotion. <laughs> Desperately seeking for someone she recognised to vent about about some issues she had earlier in the day. <laughs> uh, but unfortunately couldn't find any of her friends. <laughs> Over comes Nakia. I think I've probably heard your feet stomping before I actually saw you. <laughs> Gets to the desk. She plonks herself down right opposite me and let out just a... Oh, oh. <laughs> so, naturally, my first words were, all right. <laughs> but, but what Nakia heard was, Oh my God, how are you? Like, please, <laughs> please tell me. Please tell me everything about your day and, and spare no detail. <laughs> and so with that, the ice was broken. And whilst Nakia sat there talking away, I vividly remember thinking, this, this girl's nice. She, she talks quite a bit. <laughs> But, not wanting to be rude and probably overwhelmed by the fact that I had a real-life girl actually talking to me. <laughs> I, I ignored that voice in my head and we spent the rest of the evening chatting. Day after day, we'd always have our standard catch-up. Well, what can I say? I, I was hooked. So much so, after a few weeks, I, I asked her out. But imagine my horror when she went, nah. <laughs> Take you, Nikita, to be my wife, to have and to hold on the stable. The better for worse, the richer for life. In sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, to let us do part. And in the presence of God, I make this vow. Having to hold from this stable with the better for worse, the richer for poorer in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, for death us do part. In the presence of God, I make this vow. Nikita, I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you. With the love of God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Jones, I give you this ring 
as a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you. Within the love of God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. We will make sure that we keep each other eternally happy. We shall support each other in times of happiness, in times of sorrow, as long as we live. We will not knowingly do any deeds that may harm either of the partners. We promise to be true and faithful to each other. We shall give due respect to each other's family members, from the youngest to the eldest, and promise to live in harmony with them. We shall work together towards creating a prosperous household. We will always be strong, strong and, and complementary to, to each other, other and, and we'll spend the rest of our lives, lives as, as the best, best of friends. friends. Everyone who knows Nikita and James as a couple will acknowledge that they are both knowledgeable, high achieving, driven people. Nikita has a lot of energy about her and James goes about his business in a more calm and sturdy way, which in my head creates a perfect balance for a couple. I've always looked up to both you and James and you'll make a great addition to the family and I'm honoured to call you a sister. Another time at my sister Alice's birthday party we were all reminiscing about how Nikita and I had first met at secondary school. Alice added that she was only four years old at the time that we'd met. In true Nikita style, Nick responded, Have you ever known life without me? <laughs> and the answer was no. <laughs> and I don't think any of us could ever imagine life without you now. <laughs> Over the years, Nick has consistently been the best friend I could ever ask for, the most entertaining person we know, and the biggest ray of sunshine in our lives. She and James are truly wonderful people and they deserve a lifetime of happiness together. James, when I first met you, I thought you were an absolute gent. And as I've got to know you through the years, my opinion of you has only gotten better. I would say we found a new level in our relationship when we found leftover chicken wings in the chicken shop and decided to eat them. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> you're fun to be around and your general knowledge and smartness has always impressed me. It's easy to see why my sister loves you. The relationship that you guys have comes across as so effortless and happy, and you clearly help each other learn and grow. James, as lovingly crazy and spontaneous as Nick can be, from a girl who wasn't even in her 20s to the amazing woman that she is now, you have always been a solid constant in her life, and we love you for that. Nick, since knowing you from the age around 12, people have often thought that we were sisters, twins, lovers, related in some way, and all of that is pretty much true. <laughs> You've not only become a part of just my life, but also my family as well. I know this is hard to believe, but I didn't frequent the library that often myself. <laughs> so when I did meet, meet Nikita, I could clearly see that he'd met his match, and anyone that knows them and been more than five minutes with them together can see that they are definitely a match. They say that opposites attract, but in James and Nikita you can see where opposites attract and similarities flourish. I would like to say how lucky you are James to be leaving here with a beautiful caring wife and how lucky you are Nikita to be leaving here today with an amazing dress and a bouquet of flowers. <laughs> We are extremely proud and happy for you that what's happening to me today? <laughs> what's happening to me today? <laughs> I think it's uh, I think it's uh, 
it's more emotion than drink. <laughs> <laughs> bit of, bit of both. Yeah, probably yes. Yeah. <laughs>